Hey guys, Bryce Alf here, and welcome back to Lemmings on the Famicom. That's super. No, it's the Super NES, not the Famicom. That's super. That's silly. Let's get on with Kamanwa lemmings on, which is not how you say that at all, and I don't give a flying toot of a pa. That's a patoot. Okay. We've got to save 20 out of 30. That, I believe, is a, is a stomping trap. So... We are going to want to... Is this splat height? I don't think so. Of course, they're going to go in a... Get through! Oh, God. Alright, we can save this guy? Yeah, we can save this guy anyway. Save these guys by making them turn around, except they're not all turning around. Crap vapors. That's fine. You can just do that, and you can do that, and you gotta remember to do this. I'm trying to save everyone here is the thing, and I don't know if I really should be, but I'm trying, damn it. Stop walking through. Oh, well, some of you are gonna die. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. There's just green and blue everywhere. No. Oh my god, I'm the worst person who ever lived. Why would I pause it right there? Oh god! Can some of them get through that? Yeah, some of them can actually walk through it. That's kind of funny. And you guys can just fall the long way down. And some of you who walk through the jaws of death get to still enjoy the fruits of your labor. Awesome. Oh my god, that, that's going to live with me to the rest of my days. If Peter L90 is watching out there somewhere, I may be worse than Round the Wheel, because he never paused it on a squish animation like that. He may have done it to them, but dear god, man, he... Oh god. Just, oh god. <laughs> lemmings, lemmings everywhere, and 50% to be saved. That sounds like fun. 50 out of 100. We can do that. Especially the way I play. Alright. We're back in these crystalline formations, and we just got to... Looks like we just gotta dig and bash our way through the web down to here. Seems pretty simple. They should walk right up this stuff. I don't see any problems. Again, it's another 9-9 release rate. I guess they're just getting some of these in a group here. Oh, it's how much is that doggy in the window? I think. Maybe. Let's just go. There we go. Good enough. I think one of them turned around and is making his way out of the uh, the cave here. There he is. Actually, I should probably turn him around. Turn around, you goof nutter. Get yourself back in line. Just follow the line out, because we don't need to save 100%, but damn it, <laughs> we got the skills to waste. What the hell? That's a little better. We're going to see the whole snake coming in. We can still get to see them score their way in. Yeah. I'm not sure that's dogging the window. If it is, it's a really terrible version of it. You gods. Well, that was pretty, pretty fun and easy and simple and good in times, and... Nightmare on Lem Street. Number of lemmings, too. we got to save both. See what we got here. All right, we got 20 of each skill. We're going to have to... we can. We got a lot of ways we can do this, I think, really. If you want to be honest about it, we can do this a lot of ways. Yeah, but the easiest way is probably just to make them bridge build, honestly. Let's have some fun. Just bridge build them across. That should work, right? I can't see how this possibly could get screwed up. Uh, that should be enough. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this right about here. And back you off a little. Rather than having them both rammed up on the same bridge, this way they build at the same speed and they're good to go and they're fancy pantsies and it's just, it's good. It's good. All right. Let's, uh, get the basher on. Good enough. That worked. <laughs> Not exactly the way I was necessarily drawn up in the playbook. You can stop early, too. I didn't mean to double bash there. That's actually kind of dangerous to do that excess clicking. 
Uh, that just, it just is a thing. Why would they even have a trap? Why would you go near, like, oh, I'm gonna go check that trap out. I better build over the exit. <laughs> Alright, a couple shorties here all of a sudden. We might actually get through fun today, I doubt it. Let's be careful out there. Gotta save 25 out of 50. My, oh my. 25 out of 50. So, we only have 20 floaters. So if we try to just float them down to there, we're only going to get 20 out of 50. So instead, we're going to have to, uh, well, I guess we can just use a blocker again. I'm being lazy and doing it that way, but, you know, whatever. It's all good. Come on, come on out. Come on out, don't be shy. All right, and now we can just uh, do it this way. Could be fun. Yeah, that works. I'm going to have to turn him around is the only thing. That's fun. Okay. Here, let's see if I can do this. I'm going to have to do this type of skills at some point anyway. So let's mine our way down into here. And we'll do this so that they can't climb their way out. And we'll build a bridge to turn him around so he'll stop mining. And then we'll start this. Now, hopefully they can walk up through this. That's apparently a problem that can happen in uh, Lemmings as well. Let's really slow this down for myself, because that probably will help with reflex stuff that happens in this game. That should be enough right there, obviously, to keep them in. And then we just go over here, and he's going to mine down into that, and he'll bridge build and bridge build there, and then we can let them out. Doesn't seem too bad, does it? No, ma'am, it does not. And there's another thing you can do where apparently you can dig right through here so they fall into the exit and that counts as a victory. Like they'll, instead of splatting, they'll just go right into the exit. It's an un unintended part of the programming, I believe. But I'm not going to mess with that. I'm just going to try to think I'm fancy by doing this mining trick, which it really is not honestly that fancy or impressive. But I'll take what I can get. Okay, this may be a problem. Crap. This could be a problem. We'll see if they can get over that. I think they can't. Alright, let's go over here. Alternatively, I guess I could have sent him the whole way on his own and then just bridge built all the way up here, but that seems like a really excessively long way to get to the, the fun times with Chico and the man, so... Get out of there. Oh, they were all done anyway. Alright, please tell me he made it just safe. He did. I mean, that gap wasn't very wide. So now we just gotta wait and see if my plan will indeed come to fruition here. <laughs> Double steal. No! They can't get up there because it's blocked. Bye, guys. Well, doesn't that just disappoint my nuts? I ran into the same problem again, guys. But this time I had it sealed up so it wasn't going to cost me. That's good. Alright, so we're good to go on that front. Now they just got to finish marching their way up there and we'll be fine. Let's bomb him and they're fine. You'll join me at the exit once they get there. And maybe, actually you know what, I'm going to try to show off that falling into the exit glitch with this last guy. I'll see if I can pull that off. I'm going to have more than enough saves, so it'll be all fine. One sec. Well, here we go. Oh, it wasn't the last guy, so maybe there'll be two. This guy may not have as good of a shot as the rest. We'll see. Didn't get him to too. Nope. Oh, God! He didn't make it. And he didn't make it. Maybe it's got to be right in the middle, or maybe it doesn't work on this version. Interesting. Huh. Nice. Now that I stopped being terrible. All right. If only they could fly. Probably the last level for today. Maybe. I was thinking we could rip through, but ah, eh, no. 60 out of 100. Let's see how we do. If only they could fly. If only I had a brain, guys. If only I had a brain. Alright, so. Let's see, 60 out of 100. So, we're going to have to basically build a bridge up to the exit from there? Alternatively, I guess we could build here and, like, build bridges and put blockers on them? Maybe? I don't know. This is, this has got some interesting conundrum to it, though, needless to say. Let's see how it goes. Start digging. And you dig there. And you dig there. And you are going to dig there. Now, 
Herein lies the problem. Hmm, how do I... I'm gonna wanna try to... I'm gonna try to build just a big, long bridge all the way up, rather than trying to do the blockers on the bridge thing. Alright, good. Alright, oh wow, that went really well. I actually got everyone out, so that's good. Alright, so how long of a bridge am I going to have to build? Like from about here? Let's try it from there. Let's see how this goes. That's probably way too low, and I'm going to have to do some uh, careful uh, manipulating. Anyway, you'll join me as this goes along. Okay, as you can see, that did not work out to my favor, so I'm going to have to build up here, turn them around, I can drop them here probably, and build out this way, and then build up that way. Alright, that's the new plan, since the old plan failed incredibly miserably. Very incredibly miserably, I might add. Ye gods, so miserably. Definitely wasn't the prettiest solution, to say the least. <laughs> I had to do a bunch of turning around back and forth to get this high enough that they could actually get into the exit. But it's gonna get it done. So you can just shave that off as the lexicon goes. I can stop pausing. I just do that out of habit because I want to make sure I'm not screwing anything up. Come on, you crazy snake. Make your way to that exit. Yeah, definitely not ideal. But it got the job done, and that's all I'm interested in. You know, the fact that that thing is shooting flame out of, it, out of its nostrils makes me think that it's really got some serious health issues, or it's a terrible um, lo uh, alternate logo for the Calgary Flames, one or the other. Anyway guys, that's going to do it for today. Join us next time when we'll move on to level 29, Laura Laura Lemmings. That could be interesting. See you guys next time.